Good day everybody, it's Jerry from BSK Garage. In today's video, we're gonna look at the Kuwait Smart Digital Multimeter. And I think it uses the term smart because it has an auto feature that it can automatically detect whether you're gonna measure voltage or resistance. Everything is neatly packed in the left-hand side. That's the multimeter itself, the KM601 Digital. Comes with six batteries, a temperature probe, and your multimeter leads, as you can see right there. And you can see it's all digital. I'm a tech person, so I like it. It's digital, power buttons up top. You can see it powered up, and you got the screen there. And it automatically, it's also got a flashlight at the back. But it automatically goes to auto, and it switches between all those until it detects what it is that you're trying to measure. So I just switch it to resistance there. And of course, at the bottom, it shows the lights. So whatever mode you're going to select is going to tell you where to plug your leads into and you just keep pressing the button to go to the different modes and of course it'll tell you what leads it goes to but all of them will take the same leads the same spot until you get to measure the amps then of course it will change as you're gonna see right here one more and it says for milliamps you got your common and your milliamps lights up and then measure amps maximum 10 it goes to that spot let's power this bad boy up we'll start doing some testing with it trying it out but i do like it has this function that you can test for hot wires Even just a power cord. We're just gonna go to some simple, simple DC volts. You can see right there where it's flashing. Terminals go in the bottom. That's where we gotta be. All right. I do like the digital features for sure. What I do like about this this is the genesis dual battery system this isolates the battery so my main battery is this one here and this is my secondary battery so it isolates them both through there so 12.14 and then the main battery is 12.05 they're really close so now i just switched it over i'm just going to start measuring some resistance. All right, just randomly touch leads in the fuse panel here 12.05 see which fuses have power going across the board Interesting. It's so ones that don't have power. Just light up like that. It 
So there you have it. Comes in its own little case. I just do basic measurements when I use a meter. I won't even need like half of those features. But for what I need to do on automotive work and basic household current, I think it'll work out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or comments, post them below. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next one.